today we're doing Collide by Howie Day. Uh, it's a really nice little four chord song, good one to sing along to, and it's pretty simple if you are just kind of starting out in the beginner and stuff like that. Uh, the rhythm is a little bit complicated, it's got some 16th notes in there which is a good one to kind of get these down. Uh, so we'll talk about that and then we'll look at the chords in some detail, but as I said it's fairly simple. Uh, there's a little bit of finger picking in the bridge, which again if you've not done a lot of finger picking it's a great one to do that. Uh, I mentioned in some of my other videos that YouTube have brought out this thing now where you need more subscriptions uh, to stay as a partner, so sorry to do it, but if you could subscribe, that would be wonderful. And uh, check out all my videos coming out and stuff, and yeah, let's go for a closer. Okay guys, so first things first, Kappa on the 4th fret. Uh, I've seen him play it live on the 3rd fret as well, so it depends on what version you're listening to. Uh, but the record's on the 4th. Uh, we've got 4 chords. G, playing that 4 finger G. D, and he does some little fiddly bits with the little finger, but we'll talk about that. E minor, and C. Okay, so, and it's a bar each every time. So, let's talk about the rhythm. This is the slightly tricky bit. We've got some 16th notes, so they're counted 1 E and uh, 2 E and uh, etc. What we're going to have is we're going to have a down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. Yeah, that's a bit confusing, so I split it up into halves. So down, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up. One, two, uh, don't play the three, you can do a ghost strum. E and, four E and, uh. I recommend writing it down when you start. So down, down, up, up, down, down. And that fourth beat, you're going to hit it harder, it's going to be an accented strum. So I will play that for you a couple of times, really slow. One, two, a, uh, e, and, four, e, and, uh. Just makes that last bit sound a bit quicker. So I'll do it more up speed. Get that down and you've got the whole song ready. D, E minor, C. And just on the D sometimes, as I was saying, he puts his little finger in to make it a D sus 4, third fret of the E. You can take it off, you can even go down to a D sus 2 and just fiddle around with it really. Uh, the bridge is the only different bit, we've got a bit of finger picking. We go from G to C add 9, which is like a G but move these fingers to down a string each, uh, and then D, or D sus 2. Um, which is without the middle finger. So, there are the chords. Right hand is going thumb on the bass, thumb on the D string, and then G and B you're going to pick with your middle and your index at the same time. And do the same thing C add 9, but move your thumb down a string, so it's A then D. And then just a little strum of that D sus2, mainly aiming for the middle strings. Could do a little pluck there, sorry. Whichever you prefer. Uh, you do that three times. And then you're back into... everything. Okay, great stuff guys. Uh, as I say, pretty simple song. Uh, it's just that right hand getting that right hand down. And uh, it's a good one to you know, belt it out and stuff. So have some fun with that. As always, comments, questions, put them in below, any requests you've got. And uh, yeah, if not, I'll see you next time.